back in the day, a uh, police officer pulled me over on, uh, on Bankhead Highway. And, uh, you know, he radioed in, I'm pulling over a roller skate. And so, uh, cop goes, comes up, says, uh, I need to look in this car. And uh, he looked in, he goes, man, this is awesome. You know, he said, uh, y'all need to drive, y'all drive safe, okay? And uh, so, but he pulled me over because he wanted to, he wanted to pull over a roller skate car. Hi, I'm Jeff Cooey, owner of Sparkles Family Fun Centers here in Kennesaw, Georgia. And you're with the Sparkle Skate Car right now. Uh, this car was uh, born in around 1975. A man named J.T. Strickland uh, built nine of these cars. Uh, this is fiberglass boot. And uh, this is a, uh, it come like a Volkswagen like a bus frame. And then what he did, he cut the inside out of it and then put a, a uh, like a metal piece in there to connect it so it could look just like a, like a plate under here, like a roller skate plate. So this, is, this car was uh, two, two parts to put it together and, and it split right down the middle and he put that together and then he put this door on opens up that's where you get in at in the back to drive the skate car you have the front toe stop toe stops fiberglass but this car was very difficult to build back in the day i mean it was all done by hand everything was done by hand and uh, matter of fact i've got old pictures of it from the uh, wooden ladders he made to uh fiberglass this boot so uh, other than that uh, got a crystal ball under here every kid in america always asks me when i always talk about this skate car they say what is that underneath the skate car and i says that crystal ball is in every roller skating rink in america and another thing the kids always ask is uh, how fast does it go i said real fast Volkswagen engine very loud too when i crank it I'm probably heard that well this one used to be a, a, a black one and then it had two white stripes and then it had the top on it the top was bolted in so I took the top off and made it like a uh, you know like a low top speed skate boot uh, and and so I did that and then I painted it red and then I had a, a guy airbrush it for me to put the the flames on it tires are uh, that was one of the things that had the small tires back in the day, and now we put the rocker, rocker rims on it, the bigger tires, so it, it caught a lot of attention with that, you know, the bigger tires and wheels. I taught to kindergartners, first, second, third graders in uh, career building days. I do a lot of touch of trucks, but the community, they're always calling me to come to an event that they're putting on. So I get, to, I get to connect with a lot of people. I do a lot of networking. Uh, get to, to get a lot of private parties off from this car, all these events I go to. Earliest history I know about it is Mr. Strickland from Daytona, Florida. He uh, probably had his first car, I'd say in some time in the early 70s, but these cars were built in, in, in the 75s, in the, that era. Uh, and he ended up uh, building nine of these. Nine of these cars were built in 1975 and probably between 75 and 79. I would say there's probably seven that, that I know that's probably still alive. My father paid $8,000 for this car. And I just created the mold for, uh, for just like this, I created this mold. There was never a mold made on this. It's all done by hand by Mr. Strickland. But I own the mold for the uh, boot. And so I created that, had, had it created. Uh, and then I built my first car with uh, Paul Strickland and he ended up making history in that with me. So I was really glad to, glad Paul come along with me on that. And then I seen them on cell towers way up there and they're working on them. I'm driving by and I watch them. I just, and they stop and they're way up there and they're looking down and they're pointing. That's, 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 
when this pulls, it stops them. And they talk about their day of skating. That kind of stuff, you know, it's just a lot of a lot of stuff you see along the way. Yeah. And the smiles and people that you are riding down the road and next thing you know it, you see them smiling. Next thing you know it, you see, oh, uh, the, the mom or dad goes, hey, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny. And this Johnny's in the back, you know, in the car seat. You can't even see nothing. And look, sparkle skate car, skate car. And I mean, it's so cool. It's so cool to watch the excitement, uh, the energy of what this brings.